Hello, this is GeoTechLand and today I'll be showing off Ubuntu Touch 16.04 OTA4 and as you can guess from the name it is based on Ubuntu 16.04 LTS let me show you here the actual OS build details and so the biggest thing with this release is that it is going to be good for security because now you're no longer using 15.04 and that's no longer getting security patches as it is based on Ubuntu 15.04. Um, for some devices like this Nexus 5, the camera. So the camera still um, is able to take pictures, but it does freeze. And what you have to do is uh, close the application, reopen the camera, take another picture. So that's being worked on. And of course, you still can't record. Still the same issue where it freezes. Um, but that's going to be taken care of in OTA 5, which is set to be launched uh, in the next month or so. One app that I um, discovered that it was already out there before is the web app creator. So if you're running to an issue where you want to create a web app of, of maybe, let's say, a, a site that you always visit, you can do it with this app here. I used to think it was for like developers, but anyone can really use it to build an app. So that, that's a very neat feature. It's built into like a lot of Android devices where you just add to home screen. That's essentially what it does. Um, of course, you've got all the essentials. You got the YouTube app. Here, I'm going to whip out the unofficial Facebook web app, I believe it is. And I always say that um, the core of a phone is obviously you need to be able to make phone calls, uh, you know, have a uh, an access social media. I think those are the, the most critical of all. All right, so here you can see scrolling through my Facebook page, there's the Instagram app there. Another essential, I know it's critical for a lot of people. And here's the YouTube app, of course. The only thing I noticed with this YouTube app that it it's it's very much the web version of it and YouTube does not let you change the quality so when I watch a video on there the quality is it's alright it's watchable but you can't really switch it to like 1080p or anything like that and yes you can see three Twitter apps um, only one of them actually works although it's you have to press the home button you'll get some weird message but it does work and it looks nice so again it's uh, I can manage my Twitter account from here I'll go ahead and go to the Linux gamers page and like an app or like a post here a tweet let me also show off the UNAV app just to show you GPS is working smooth here so yeah, you can see it pretty quickly reads my location and I know Google Maps is critical for a lot of people so let me show that off as well Just test location and yeah you guys can see location is also working fine and let me actually show off some of the games here um, I don't think there's been any new major games but there's a fun one I play Sometimes here we do need roads So you gotta like not hit the bricks kind of reminds me of the flappy bird style But again, I never considered gaming on phones critical just because of batteries you need to preserve that battery And phones get crazy hot and And it's just not ideal for a gaming device, for a full-fledged gaming device. So little games like this here, I'm pretty much perfectly content. And as it, as this OS grows and gains in popularity, I think you'll see even better games. And it'll be a, like a sugar on top for me, I think. Of course, there's the Paddle Warrior game. 
think I've shown that off before. It has the best music. But yes, other than that, guys, this is a very stable OS. If you have a device or if you're interested in um, installing this on your device, I'll put some helpful links down below. And yeah, this is an OS you should at least try. Um, personally, for me, it can't be used as a daily driver still until we get, um, until it's ported to a newer phone. Because I just have. Um, you know, it has to be a pretty decent camera and a lot of the phones that it's working on, I don't think the camera is that good yet. But other than that guys, if you found the video helpful, please give it a like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.